What is going on everybody, TD Presents here bringing you some my team and if you missed the last video we opened up some packs, I'm trying to complete a team of my favorite players and we got two steps closer, we got Paul Pierce, we got Tim Duncan and now it's time for these players to make their debut, I'm trying to do something different, bring you guys a team you usually wouldn't see or play against. And also, I'm trying to play team basketball, trying to replicate the style of the San Antonio Spurs. And Bill Russell's going to complete probably the slowest fast break I've seen in 2K. But it doesn't matter. It's still worth two points. But my opponent's going to come right back. You're not going to see many offensive highlights from him because that's really all it was. Michael Jordan going into the lane, either doing a Euro step dunk or a spin move layup or he would get to the free throw line. So we were having problems defensively, but on offense, we were doing all right. Pete Maravich finds Paul Pierce for the open three. And then right here, my favorite player in the game, Jones finds Maravich, who goes back to Sam Jones, who goes back to Pistol Pete, who finds John Helvacek on the backdoor cut. Those two right there showing off some chemistry. My opponent is forced to take a timeout. And we're down 25 to 20, but we're still gonna slow the game down. Go inside to Bill Russell. He gets double teamed, but Bill Russell showing off the muscle converts the N1. But it seemed like every time we got close to my opponent, he would come right back. Michael Jordan, a fadeaway jumper with two defenders near him. And now Tim Duncan in the post. He brings the double team, so we find a wide open Gordon Hayward. And G Time was doing his thing. He came out on fire in the second half. Hits another three pointer right here. We cut the lead to five. And now Kawhi Leonard drives inside, misses the layup off the rim. Bill Russell going to find Paul Pierce up ahead, and he's showing off some youth in those legs. Throws down the dunk, and now Pete Maravich off the pick and roll. A wide open lane, no help defense. We cut the lead to four, but we couldn't get a stop. Now Sam Jones finds Pistol Pete on the backdoor cut. Finishes the layup plus the foul on Magic Johnson. And with under a minute left in the third quarter, we're going to trap Michael Jordan. Bradley is going to accidentally throw up a full court shot. And it ends up going in. I could not believe it. Avery Bradley with probably the longest shot I've seen in 2K14. And now on the other end, we get the steal. Bradley finishes with the dunk. But in the fourth quarter, it seemed like we were starting to take control. But he kept dominating the paint. Michael Jordan getting inside, getting to the free throw line. Now Kawhi Leonard finishing. And look at this right here. Kawhi Leonard doing what he did to the Miami Heat in the finals. A beautiful putback dunk. And you can see we were getting out rebounded 25 to 12. And whenever that happens, you're not going to win too many games. So we walk off the court with the loss. But we showed some great chemistry on offense. All we got to do is play some team defense. And we will come away with a win. We are playing another stacked team. But we got five-time NBA champion Tim Duncan. We got Bill Russell. We got Pistol Pete. And we still came out slow as ever in this game. Coming off a loss, you want to have a good start. And we did the exact opposite. Derrick Rose driving in. Tim Duncan gets stuck in an animation. Probably my biggest pet peeve in 2K14. I know they have said in 2K15 a lot of that will be fixed. But D. Rose, he wasn't just finishing dunks. He was hitting three-pointers. But if you look at Sean Kemp, I have no idea what he's doing. He's going over to the scores table. We end up finding a wide-open Tim Duncan. And now later on in the first quarter, Bill Russell misses the fadeaway jumper. I mess up the release. Michael Jordan, one-on-one -on -one with Paul Pierce, gets called for the charge on the fast break. And after that play, we started to gain some momentum. Pistol Pete crosses Steph Curry, hits the pull-up jumper. And now with under five seconds remaining in the first quarter, comes loose on the pick and roll, hits the three-pointer, and he was not done. Starting off the second quarter, this time, step back jumper on Derrick Rose. And at one point, he had everything to do with our scores, whether it was scoring or it was an assist. We're down 34 to 32 at this point. Tim Duncan misses the putback dunk, and Scottie Pippen finishes a beautiful reverse jam. But for some reason, he doesn't get back on defense. We have a 5-on-4 advantage. Paul Pierce finds a wide-open Gordon Hayward. And he is starting right where he left off last game. Hits another three-pointer. And once again, Paul Pierce is going to make the extra pass. He hits a pretty deep two-pointer, but he wasn't done there. Hayward gets MJ in the air on the pump fake and hits the three-pointer once again. So we take the lead. My opponent is forced to take a timeout. But Derrick Rose crossing over Pistol Pete. 
finishes with the reverse dunk. I hope we see that this year in the Eastern Conference because the Eastern Conference has the potential to be worse than they were last year, believe it or not. Tim Duncan, acrobatic finish underneath, and now it's a game tied. Going inside, Bill Russell, two defenders around him. It doesn't matter. He gets the layup to go. We're tied at 58 apiece. Maravich is going to fight Duncan underneath, who's going to get to the free throw line. So we're going back and forth. Neither of us can seem to get a stop. Paul Pierce comes off the screen. Nice little pump fake finishes underneath. And now 61-59. Jordan going inside. Maravich gets the block off the backboard. We're looking to run in the fast break. Paul Pierce pulling up for the jumper. Misses it. Westbrook gets the rebound. And now he's coming back the other way. Russell Westbrook going to pull up for three. And he is going to make his first shot of the game. One for seven, and it couldn't have come at a bigger time. He takes a 62 to 61 advantage, but Maravich comes right back. Beautiful behind the back, gets fouled on the pull up jumper, and now with a minute 18 left, tied at 63. Maravich goes inside, misses the layup. Derrick Rose gets the rebound, and this is where this game is going to come to an end. I have no idea what happened. He's dribbling against the sideline. I don't know how he's not going out of bounds. He finally does after about 10 or 15 seconds. And it wouldn't be long before it says your opponent has left the match. So we are having a great game. It was coming down to the wire. And then for some reason, it says your opponent has left the match. I end up getting the W. And all I gotta say is, next episode, be prepared. Because we have a player you didn't even see in this video who's gonna come off the bench and absolutely go off against Michael Jordan. So stay tuned for that. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed. I'm out.